Hi, this video today I will show you how to create tab menus for mobile design. Okay, so now let's start it. I will open Azure project I'm working on and now I will create a new page. Okay. Oh, tab. Okay. And then I will change the style for this one. Pet dimension. I select the iPhone 11 Pro version. Save it. Okay. And here I have some tab. I use a button. I have heading one. Product detail. Turn the tag here is product detail one, detail two. Okay, name this one is tab one, tab two. Okay. And I change the style for this one. I select the corner visibility. Okay. And I have a box. This box will be using for displaying the detail. Bigger. Okay, so this is a product detail con one control. I got duplicate another box two. Okay, one, two. Save. and then I select the product content detail one right click on this one and I select the create dynamic panel okay I will name it is the one okay I change it to ally yeah and then I will select the state one. I will duplicate to create another state for a dynamic panel one. Okay, state number two. And then for the state number two, I will drop the. I will add the product detail to content underneath of state two. Okay. In the state two, I will have the box here. Okay. I will select the state one. In the detail of the state one, I have some the information like product detail zero one. I select the state number two. Product detail. Zero two. Okay. Bow. Change the font size. Okay. Close this one. I save it. And then, when the I will use, I will change the color for this one. Fin color will be the no. Oh. 
in. Okay, let it by default. Run it. Yeah. Okay. So now I'm going to add some the event for tab number one and tab number two. Select this one. I select the interaction. Okay. Click on new interaction. I select the click or tab. Select the set panel state. Dynamic panel one. I will select the state one for this one. Do the same thing even for the product detail tab number two. Click or tab and set panel state. Panel one and change it to state number two. Okay. Save it and then I run it for testing. Yeah, so when we select the tab number two, the content will be changed it to product detail number two. The same thing, okay. Okay, so now here I will update some style to indicate which tab is selected now. So now I will select this bot, this bot tab. Okay, and the selection group I will admit is tab control group. Okay, I will select the selected add new action for product detail tab one. I will select the set selected checkbox. Okay. This with this. Okay. Do same. Do the same thing with the tab number two. This with this. Okay. So now here I will select the, this one. New interaction and select the style effect. I will find the color for it. Okay. Okay. So now run it for testing. Yeah. By default, the tab number one will be selected. And if I click on the tab number two, the color will be changed and the content will be changed as well. Okay. Okay, so I think that's all for today. And after you finish this video, you know how to create the uh, tab menus for the design by using Azure. Okay, I hope this video will have fun for you. Let me know if you see any issue. Bye bye and see you later. Thank you for watching.